Hi everybody, I'm Dr. Busy Riley and I want to talk to you about your thyroid. There are a lot of people with thyroid conditions out there and a lot of us on medication and a very few of us actually understand what your medication does and what your doctor is testing for. So even if you're not one of my patients, I want to make sure that your doctor is running the appropriate tests for thyroid function. So here's a little diagram. Here's your head, here's your neck, here are your shoulders, and here is your thyroid. It's a butterfly-shaped gland at the very bottom of your neck. And basically, when your doctor runs blood work on you, many people only test TSH. So TSH is thyroid stimulating hormone. It comes from a place in the brain and basically goes to your thyroid gland and stimulates your thyroid gland to manufacture thyroid hormone. So the problem with this is that your thyroid makes many different kinds of hormones, but the main two hormones are T4 and T3. Most people, when they have low thyroid function, are put on levothyroxine, which is T4. And T4 will feed back to the brain on what's called a negative feedback cycle. So when you take enough thyroid hormone, it'll quiet down your brain's need to stimulate the thyroid. So basically, when your TSH is high, that means your thyroid is needing more stimulation. And when your TSH is low, that means that your thyroid is kind of over-functioning and you're getting a lot of this inhibitory feedback to the brain. So the problem with this situation is that actually T4 doesn't do very much in your body. T3 is active thyroid hormone. And T4 goes out into your body and has to be converted in, that's an arrow, in case anyone's wondering, converted into T3. So many people will be on levothyroxine, their TSH will look absolutely fine, but the reality is that your active thyroid hormone or your T3 is still low. So this is why a lot of times when we look at people's blood work, if we're just looking at TSH, we're not getting the full story with the thyroid. So when you come to the naturopathic clinic of Issachar, we always check your TSH, your free T4, and your free T3 so that you can get the complete picture. You might have questions about glandular thyroid versus thyroid that you get from a pharmaceutical company like levothyroxine. The difference is that glandular thyroid or armor thyroid will have both active thyroid hormone, which is T3, and the T4, which is also converted into T3. So that's one of the main differences and questions that people ask us. So if you have concerns that you might still have thyroid symptoms, but your thyroid hormones te uh, technically look fine, please ask your doctor to run all of these tests. I'm Dr. Busy Riley. Live like you give a damn.